Today we want to show you a little neat thing that you can do with the Sony Ericsson Live Dock, an accessory which will be available uh, soon. Uh, the accessory itself basically is a uh, mobile phone stand that comes with uh, a regular USB connector, a micro USB connector for power, and um, the dock itself can be connected to um, any phone from Sony Ericsson running Android and um, having a micro USB connector as well. So what we want to show you today is um, what you can do using, for example, an external keyboard and a mouse. To do this, I have here a uh, wireless keyboard and mouse connection. So this is just a receiver. What I'm going to do is I'm going to connect that with uh, the LiveDocs USB uh, connector, just like that. And on the other end, I obviously have here my wireless mouse, I have my wireless keyboard, and I have an Xperia Ray. And I'm going to connect that now to the live dock. And now watch what happens when I um, connect the accessory. As you can see, it says USB receiver connected. And you can also see that there is now a little mouse pointer appearing in the middle of the screen. And if I use uh, my mouse, I can basically use the phone via the mouse, just like on a, on a, on a computer. I can click on icons, um, I can flip through things here using the mouse. Um, the right mouse button actually works as uh, the back button, so clicking on the right mouse button is the same like clicking on the back button here on the phone itself. If I use the middle wheel button here on the mouse, it acts as um, the context menu button, just like the one below here. So there's pretty much um, the same possibilities to use the phone as I have them when I use uh, just my finger to navigate uh, and things like that. Now this by itself, it's pretty cool, but you cannot really use it. Um, the real usage comes when uh, we go to our keyboard. And to show you this, I'm just going to start um, the color note, the notes application. And I'm going to put this on uh, the dock. Now let's say um, you're writing a lot of emails from your phone, or you're texting a lot, or Facebooking a lot. Um, it's actually pretty neat to have a, a real keyboard connected. So what I can do, I'm just using my arrows now on the keyboard. I can also use them to navigate on uh, the phone through the different menu points. So I want to add a new note. As you can see here too, I can navigate or I can use the mouse, whatever is more convenient or whatever is available. I'm just going to write a new text now. Um, now obviously this works in all applications on the phone, also in email or in text. I just use the notes for uh, um, easier handling. And obviously I'm much faster. As you can see, it is pretty fast and pretty convenient, especially if you have to write longer texts. And also on the keyboard, you have the possibility to navigate, so I can use the escape button to go back. Now it saved my message. One more time, I go back, and once more, I'm out of the application. For some reason, the Sony Ericsson home screen does not support um, the landscape mode, so I have to switch that here for uh, easier for showing you a couple of more things. So I can use, as I mentioned before, I can also use my arrow keys on the, on the keyboard to navigate. I can go down here, I can go to my, uh, my menu, my home menu. Also here I have the possibility, possibility to navigate through them. Um, a uh, click or an enter on one item opens it. Here you can see the live wear manager and you can also see that currently um, I basically have uh, the live dock connected and uh, the USB receiver. 
So I can use the keyboard pretty much to do anything I want. I can use the mouse to do what I want. And um, of course I still can use my finger. So that's not like uh, something that is exclusive now available to the mouse or the keyboard. And that's pretty much it. That's all I want to show you today. Thanks a lot for watching and see you soon on scfirst.com.